thought I had it all together, but I was led astray the day you walked away. You were the clock that was ticking in my heart. Changed my state of mind. Oh my God! Not so hard to find. Your feelings changed like the weather. When from wind to rain, all that night and day. How can I go on with a cup falling apart? Love so hard to find. When someone Gentlemen, it is time we talk about Hytale, the game created by Hypixel. I know I've slacked. I should have made this video a lot earlier, and I do realize everyone worth their salt has already come and kind of commented on this already. But I thought, you know, how oh, it's popular and it might be great for views, so we might as well chuck in all that salt. Considering, you know, and we play or have played games in a very unique style, we do it competitively. But we like to, you know, we like the aesthetic things and weird, quirky things at the same time. So, from our perspective, high tail is either going to be really good or really bad. And it all kind of depends on various aspects. But I do feel like most YouTubers on YouTube are talking absolute shit. Uh, why is this? It's because they are comparing Minecraft to high tail. They're nothing like each other. Well, in the sense that they've got blocks and they look kind of the same. But fundamentally, the principles behind each game are massive. They're, they're, there's, there's no way to compare them. You have Minecraft, which I think in Notch, when he developed the game, it was very much meant to be this sandbox world. It's open and free. There's no rules. And he didn't even quite kind of wanted to add an end to it. In the sense that you see the cinematic in Minecraft, and that was kind of there as a joke, really. There was no point of having an end. There was no storyline in Minecraft. And then you have Hytale. It comes in and it's already announced as kind of a progression as you work through the world. And I'll show pictures throughout. And, and, you know, there's massive monuments pre-generated. And these sort of things, they only came into Minecraft very late as Notch's original vision for the game changed. So uh, it's cool. Hytale, a clone of Minecraft, seems a bit stupid to me, and I don't quite know what everybody's fucking talking about, because to me, the Hytale resembles more like Terraria in a 3D world than Minecraft's ever done, and you can see this, because Hytale has these huge player-generated structures, there's bosses and a quest system. Sorry, when the fray did Minecraft ever have a bloody quest system? Because it didn't! Ever! It, it still doesn't! Today! And I don't think it ever will, and the only way that's gonna happen is servers, and that's a whole different question to be fair. We don't even know how a Hytale server will exist, and trust me, if there's a Hytale server, we're gonna be bloody on it first, so join our Discord for that. But, fundamentally, it just seems a bit ridiculous. And don't get me wrong, there are things in Hytale that are going to be amazing. And I cannot wait to play it. It's going to be great for the channel. It's going to be great for you guys. However, you know, like I said, there are things in Hytale that I really am excited for. But to compare that to Minecraft, it's, it, it's just stupid. Minecraft is very much focused for the past four years on applying itself and getting itself on every different console possible from Tamagotchi to your new Switch, right? Half the time the game's there before the new console comes out, and that's their priority. They want to get their basic game, you know, for family-friendly kids all over, everywhere. It's just kind of the way I play the game, and the way, you know, more adult kind of players play the game is kind of in contrast with that. You can tell, like, the way the tridents and crossbows have been optimized they're not about competitivity they're just about enjoying the game whereas Hytale is a classic RPG you do scale your weapons and you, you, you know it's about killing bosses and acquiring new levels similar to the the likes of World of Warcraft believe it or not and Terraria again it's difficult I, I think the game's gonna be brilliant but some youtubers are definitely gonna have to pipe it because it's not Minecraft 2. Hytale ain't gonna come out on your iPhone 76, right? It's not gonna be there. It's gonna be a, a, play a PlayStation and a PC sort of game. And like I said, ultimately, they are two different games. 
Mojang, giant company. You think they're going to be messing around? No. There's also the huge amount of plugins and mods that are available for Minecraft. You think when Hightail comes out, Minecraft is going anywhere? It is definitely not. And I bet you, a lot of people are just, it's not going to be suited to everyone. People are going to get excited for Hightail, thinking it's Minecraft, and they are going to not be happy when it comes out, because it is not going to be the same thing. And, you know, Minecraft has so many years in development, and obviously the models in Hightail, look, they are brilliant, and I love them. Uh, and, they, you know, they create all the software to help improve them and build, get them out quicker. But Minecraft's had years and years and years of fundamental development, and it, that is just not going to go away anytime soon. Like I said, Hightail will be a great game, but so is Minecraft at the end of the day, and they are two different games. So, that's my bit of a rant. If you see a YouTuber talking shit, tell him off. Make sure to give a like, subscribe to the channel. Really would appreciate it. Catch you guys on the flip side. Bye!